Guys, it's James Kennedy, Sexus Foot and Ankle Centers. I want to show you what Raynaud's phenomenon looks like. This is this is a Tyler, Texas, which Tyler doesn't get that cold, um, but sometimes it does. And when we mature in age, lots of times the toes will have a uh, a discoloration to them. You know, like I have obviously Caucasian skin, white skin. Lots of times toes will start to look white like a glove, okay? And in her feet, they are icy cold. She has, a, she has problems with circulation. What is this? Well, she's older. She's starting to have a little bit of rheumatoid to her. And she also goes to a friend of mine who is a vascular doctor here, an MD here in, in Tyler, uh, to try to help her dilate her blood vessels. But we have microscopic blood vessels inside of toes. We have four main arteries to a toe. We have a two dorsal and we have two plantar, but what happens when those vessels get smaller or they um, they condense into a, to a, a smaller tube, lots of times the patients, the toe does not get the blood circulation that it needs to, and what happens, it, it turns a, a, a whitish color. So this is what we call Raynaud's phenomenon. So um, what we try to do, we try to keep the patient as warm as possible at night and try to watch for sores and things like that. But this is what I would classify as what we call Raynaud's phenomenon on these toes right here. Thanks for watching.